I don't think anybody can argue that there has been enough infringement on the Second Amendment. You know, banning these assault rifles was stupid, meaningless. I'm not going to go into a big speech about it, but it was stupid and meaningless, and the NRA and anybody else uh, was perfectly right to be opposing it. I opposed it, too. It was stupid. Did nothing. Affected nothing. And um, so it is an infringement. I mean, uh, you know, which part of infringement do you not understand? In this atmosphere, it's not going to be overturned, obviously, and they're going to put it off uh, for a while. But it ought to be. It really ought to be. And we need watch groups. Um, that doesn't mean uh, watch groups who will pick up guns and go to try to kill people to change things. That isn't what I mean. I mean people who will go to the courts, people like the NRA, who do go to court and challenge these things as they come along. God bless them. Even the ACLU, they've done a lot of things that uh, are just fine. They protect people's Fourth Amendment right when they see violations uh, made. They protect people's First Amendment right when they see violations made. Sometimes we see an agenda in those they decide to protect, but nevertheless, they are looking after those rights. West of the Rockies, you're on the air. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. All right. Yes. Uh, two things. Uh, Alabama should be the new venue for the the uh, bombers trial. Why because Alabama? They just reinstated as of today chain gangs. Really? Yeah. And the second thing is, the NRA has not for a long time been the National Rifle Association. It's the National Revolutionary Army. No, it's not. Of course it is. No, it isn't. <laughs> Why isn't it? Uh, because they don't call for uh, armed revolution, do they? Well... Do, do they, <laughs> sir? They're sir? To the teeth and they're ready oh, for it. Oh, sir. Who do you think is going to support the militia? <laughs> Goodbye. You know, for you to try to paint the NRA as a, a organization calling for revolution is intellectually um, really disingenuous. And I can only ima imagine that your motives are the very worst. And you, sir, are part of the problem. You, you, sir, are as extreme on one end as those you bitch about on the other end. And that's the trouble in America right now. Too damn much extremism.